live in Elk Grove, finding out how you can apply. You going swimming? Yes. <laughs> I'm not going swimming. Sorry, Court. <laughs> not today. Uh, maybe next time. Although the sun came out and it's gorgeous out. So there yeah. are a ton of people in this pool here at the Wackford Aquatic Complex in Elk Grove. And when we were first driving in, I thought, isn't it cold for that? No, because this water is upper 70s, lower 80s. It's perfect, mm. especially if you want to get your life got on. They are training lifeguards and taking names and saving lives as well. All right, we've got Lauren Noonan here who is with the Kasumna CSU yes. and you all are hiring up to 100 lifeguards for this yes. summer. Yeah, so we are going to be opening the new Elk Grove Aquatic Facility. With that, we have an Olympic-sized pool, we have a six-lane teaching pool, and a humongous recreation pool with two slides, the Lazy River, and so we need a lot more lifeguards than usual okay. just so that we can Get them going, get that facility open, make sure people have fun in the water. Okay, so if somebody's at home thinking, hey, this would be a great summer job for my student, mm -hmm. for my child, what do they need to do? How old do they have to be? Yeah, so we will be hiring 15-year-olds this year, which is a new and exciting thing. Um, they do need to be lifeguard certified, and we offer those courses here with the Kasumina CSD. They can go on to yourcsd.com or come into the Wackford Aquatic Complex to register for those. They need to be 15, but other than that, just hardworking, enthusiastic, liking to be outside and in the water. I love that so much. And so what you're seeing in the pool right now, these two are actually going through some of the training exercises that yeah. would be required of someone who wants to be a lifeguard. Would you recommend that if you want to do this, you need to be the strongest swimmer, or can you learn those skills? Yeah, so I would say you can learn those skills. We do require that they can swim 300 yards in the water. They also need to be able to tread for two minutes and then be able to retrieve a brick from seven feet deep, um, which obviously that needs to be a strong swimmer, but I have lots of friends who have worked here that are not on the swim team. They come, they make their way through it, and they are excellent lifeguards and swim instructors. Absolutely. And so while they are hiring for summer positions, these very well could also turn mm -hmm. into positions beyond that, right? Yes, absolutely. We have staff on for the off season. We also have opportunities to promote so they can become lead lifeguards, pool managers. I've worked here for seven years and that went from lifeguard, lead lifeguard, pool manager, now senior recreation specialist. You can so, work on yeah. up through this program. Okay, mm -hmm. quickly, where can people go for more information? Yes, so they can go to yourcsd.com. If they want to apply to be a lifeguard, they're going to click that join our team button okay. or they can click on the lifeguard training courses and register for those. Got it. All right, Lauren, thank you so much. We're also going to make sure we post all this information on our website as well. But guys, this is a wonderful opportunity. If you have a teen at home, yeah. Yeah. you're like, you can't sit all summer. You need to be doing something. Get <laughs> right? in this pool and let him go help save some lives as a lifeguard. Back over to it's you. It's a great thing for them to do. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Tina. Appreciate it. All right, body art is something that will 